Well, Glenn Hodge is a difficult build-up to this game. What was your assessment of the actual performance today? Well, obviously, obviously disappointed again. Uh, it's the second game, uh, the last two games, Boxing Day and today. I felt that um, you know we've gone against two good teams and gone toe to toe, especially today, and uh, and we've not got anything out of them, but but maybe deserve something. So um, it was it's a tough one to take, especially the the, the mistake at the end. But you know, that's where we're in a rut. We've got to work our roll sleeves up and get ourselves out of it. What do you think we could do better at 1-1 against a leading team in the league? Perhaps? Well, you got I mean, so you got you, know, you don't you can't plan for, for what happened, and we're not blaming PK. You know, sometimes defenders make errors errors like that, and they end up in the back of the net. So you know, we we can't do that. It's just maybe maybe we, you know, I think we call so many problems first half uh, with our two front players, Ollie and, and Joe. They couldn't cope with him, and uh, and the plan was to carry it on second half, but we didn't quite do that because the mistake could have easily been at their end. So. Uh, you know, it, it is what it is at the moment. Um, but you know, they're just the players have, have responded well to the Oxford game. Now, now equally on Wednesday, we've got to make sure that they get their heads up. And, and another day, that that's a performance that could win a game. And we know from going down there how much work goes on behind the scenes on defensive shape and that kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, 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 just yeah. how difficult is it to eradicate those kind of mistakes? No, it's not. It's, you know, you just hope that you, we, we, we work with the defenders and heading and, and, and finishing and bits and pieces. And sometimes it happens. It, it, it is, it's, it's nothing you can do. You just make sure that next time we're, we're practicing crosses and you know you, you get your left foot and it and right foot and different different sorts of different sorts of clearances, but. No, we're not blaming PK today. You know, that it's one of them things, um, and we just got to make sure that um, make sure that we're bright and, and ready on, on Wednesday. At the other end of the pitch, Ollie Palmer. You spoke yeah. in the build up about you know players scoring against their former clubs. Yeah. You can go from strength to strength now. Perhaps? Yeah, I like, I, yeah, I like playing team players against their old team. They they, they have a, a little bounce in their step, and uh, and again, he he he, he uh, it's probably his best performance for us. Yeah. Uh, and I was disappointed that we did make more of it second half. We we didn't we didn't cause them. We didn't ask more questions because we had the two centre forwards that, that were causing them problems. Um, but Ollie's Ollie's got his goal, and I think he was tied there. That's his first 90 minutes for it as well. So that was the other thing. The other thing, Yako hasn't played 90. That's his first 90. Yeah. Shea hasn't played for two weeks so you know there was a few tired legs out there um, but you know overall it's, he's got his goal and I hope it's the first of many. Was you really pleased as well with the midfield balance it seems like uh, Yarko and players like Jack Rudoni were they linking up well? Yeah they're good young players they're good young players and uh, and they, they give you they've got legs and they give you a bit of bite especially Yarko in there you know he's uh, he's going to be a good player and he'll probably be tight he'll sleep well tonight and uh, and then we'll, we'll go again on Monday and assess who we've got and who we haven't got and uh, and, and plan accordingly. And a quick turnaround with Wigan coming up on Wednesday. I guess that's exactly what we want, really. Yeah, I think there's no respite, is there? So uh, you know, we I'm pleased because uh, you know if we can if we can you know we just got to get at it. It's an opportunity to to again to take the game to them and, and make sure we get get three points that uh, that you know that, or more points than we that, that we have deserved the last two games that we haven't got. That's hope so. Thanks for joining us, Glenn. Okay, cheers. Thank you.